Hello YouTube. What to do when your fans are going out? They're squealing or maybe it stopped completely. Uh, replacing them with some inexpensive fans. And I'm going to show you how we do that right now. Alright, so a few weeks ago, modded a Strix RX 470. And we're going to go ahead and do it to a Strix 480. Got one fan. that has to be jump started right in the middle and we're gonna go ahead and replace it with aftermarket fans just like we did right here this card runs cooler than the stock fans so let's see if we can do it again with a three fan Strix card. Alright, supplies you're going to need to mod your graphics card. You're going to need a graphics card with dead or broken fans. Uh, the reason why this one is broken, the center fan needed to be jump started and when I jump started I nicked the blade. So this card is no longer under warranty because it has physical damage. And then you're going to need some case fans, 80 millimeter fans, about the same size. And you're going to need some zip ties. And let's go ahead and take this thing apart and see how the temperatures are after we mod it. So we've done the modification, the card's running at 55 degrees. So it's not a huge improvement, but it is an improvement. Uh, the main thing is, is that you'd want to do this if you have your fans die, like we did on the 470. That was a huge improvement. The two fans uh, that were replaced them were about 80 millimeters in size. The Strix three fan configuration, these are actually pretty good fans. So. Uh, the ones we replaced it with are a little bit smaller and you can see it still looks pretty cool um, you can see the other one behind it that's unmodded and so it's got three fans but it still runs uh, about the same maybe a little bit better but what's nice about it is if you start having fans that start squealing or going out completely like we've had with some of these other cards uh, the bearings go bad they start to squeal and then they stop running at all and then you actually burn up your cards so this is a good solution to fixing that without having to RMA with the GPU shortage right now 
uh, I imagine it would probably take forever to get any replacement cards if they were even available. All right, thank you guys for watching. I'm going to try to do regular once a week videos of different ways of making some money from mining, like buying different altcoins and different things that you can do with it and other ways to make some money from mining. Uh, leave me some comments below of what you guys would like to see some more of. Uh, make sure you guys hit that like button and subscribe.